Hi, how are you? Okay, now I'm going to do a small review. I'm going to start with beats. This is both for step 2 and step 3. And the first topic that I'm going to use is how to differentiate the caput and the cephala hematoma. Okay, as you can see here, caput, the word caput at the end has this cross, right? The T at the end looks like a cross, so the caput would cross the sutures. That's the first thing. This is really, really high G all day. Really like to ask what's the difference and which one cross and which one don't cross the suture. So you know the caput that ends in the T, which looks like a cross, they cross the sutures. And cephalo no hematoma, if you see this is like a no, they won't cross the suture. So this is the first thing that you have to remember. Caput cross the suture and cephalo no hematoma, they don't cross the suture. And also remember that in both cases, you don't need extra studies, no x-rays, no x-rays, and no extra tests. So you see? I'll keep up, uh, uploading videos like this, just short videos with high yield information. Thanks for watching, and more videos will be coming soon, so don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.